Coming up next on Movie 12, You Can't Cheat an Honest Man, starring W.C. Fields and Charlie McCarthy. Save up to 50% on a large selection of albums, stereos, musical instruments, and more at Recordhead. This Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, Recordhead, 68th in Lincoln and 74th in Hampton. The already great buy on Buick's all-new Somerset just got better. Now, 8.8% GMAC financing on all-new Buick Somersets. You not only get Somerset's very affordable base price of just $9,034, but save hundreds in financing costs. And Somerset's high-tech instrumentation is standard. 8.8% financing now on Buick Somerset. Now's the time to move up to Buick. Wouldn't you really rather have a Buick? Dinosaurs once dominated the earth. Today, they are extinct because they could not compete in their changing environment. Is your business becoming a dinosaur? Struggling to compete in a changing business environment? Attend Channel 12's free television advertisers seminar. We'll show you how to compete in today's advertising environment. Oh yes, it's a jungle out there. Consumer self-defense, all this week at 6. <laughs> Coming up next on Movie 12, You Can't Cheat an Honest Man, starring W.C. Fields and Charlie... The double 10 sale at Mitchell Carpet on 6th and Mitchell and 92nd and Silver Spring. This is the final week. This is your last chance to save 20, 40, 60% off retail on over 60,000 yards of carpet still in Milwaukee. Take a good look at your carpet because this is the final week. Builders, renters, homeowners, landlords, apartment owners, bring your truck, van, wagon, or car. Cash and carry guaranteed 48-hour installation. Mitchell Carpet now two locations, South 6th and Mitchell, North 92nd and Silver Spring. Be there! I found the car that I wanted at the price I wanted to pay for at Phil Token. We were treated uh, much better here than at any other dealership in the area. Buy Phil Token, absolutely. A fantastic buy at Phil Token. I would tell you to come to Phil Token. They have a good selection of cars. They have an outstanding service department. And they're fun people to work with. Find out for yourself what thousands of Milwaukeeans already know. Nobody ever beats the Phil Token deal. Singles 85 is a new, exciting exposition for single people at Mecca on June 15th and 16th, 11 a.m. to 12 midnight each day. Seminars and exhibits. Dancing Saturday night. Casino night Sunday. Singles run Sunday morning. Grand prizes Saturday and Sunday are a carnival cruise to Nassau and a trip to Las Vegas. Your 1250 admission includes both the Lakefront Festival of the Arts and Singles 85. Call 342-2656 for information about this exciting event. Disgusting, isn't it? You want to go on vacation, out for a good time, or just shopping, and he's got you worried. We understand. We're Wisconsin's oldest and largest alarm retailer. We have a full line of top quality alarms and equipment. You can do it yourself, or we'll do it for you. And this month, we're running a very special sale. Free installation and 90 days same as cash to qualified customers. Rid yourself of this pest. Come to 7-Eleven Security Stores, 47th and Burleigh. Pizza makers everywhere have developed highly sophisticated factories to make their pizza. So has Little Caesars. For instance, this is the highly sophisticated factory that makes our cheese. This is the automated plant that makes our special sauce. And these are the sophisticated machines that put it all together. At Little Caesars, we still make pizza the old-fashioned way. We make it. And we always give you the second pizza free. Because when you make a pizza this good, one just isn't enough. Perk up your car, van, or truck with a LeVan frameless sunroof from Klein Dickert Glass. Your LeVan sunroof will help increase ventilation and add resale value while giving your car an exciting look. Special solar cool glass blocks out the sun's harmful rays without blocking out light. Multiple position openings and fully removable glass. Prices start as low as $144.95 installed. Let our factory trained installers give your car brand new style. Plus our written no leak guarantee. The LeVan sunroof at Klein Dickert Glass, 131st in Capitol. Home run. That's all bases. Reminds me of We Care Nursing Service. They touch all bases, take care of everything, give you all the help you need to stay in your own home, even supply the medical equipment, beds, wheelchairs, this thing. They have a great team of professionals who care for you and about you. For my money, 
We care's a winner. Better believe it. At Nelson Brothers Furniture, only $4.88 buys your choice living room, bedroom, or dining room set. A beautiful living room group is just $4.88, including tables, lamps, and pictures as your bonus extras. A four-piece bedroom set is also just $4.88. Your choice, five-piece dining room suite or seven-piece dinette set, only $4.88. Use your credit power now at Nelson Brothers. And you don't have to wait for delivery. Nelson Brothers loves me, and they love you too. Open Sundays. Carpeting worn, threadbare, colorless. If you're thinking about beautiful new carpeting, and if you're thinking we just can't afford it right now, let me give you an idea. Call Lincoln Carpeting and we'll deliver beautiful new carpeting for three rooms for only $289 in a choice of dozens of new decorator colors with convenient credit terms. Three full rooms of carpeting, just $289. Call for a free in-home estimate now. Call 271-7060-271-7060. Mike Murphy was like any kid of the 50s. You must be Michael Murphy. Yeah. How did you know? Just a lucky guess. But this was 1968. Even in the 70s, Mike stayed loyal to the 50s. Today, Mike Murphy has lots of loyal WISN listeners who love the sock hop songs and other favorites he plays. Slow one by the Tune Weavers next. Hey, Murph. Hey, what? Nice shirt. Is that new? Yeah, right. WISN AM 1130. Good people, good music, good news, good day. Success. Spectacular success. To celebrate, Volkswagen presents the Success Celebration. Your chance to get exciting deals on all the exciting 1985 Volkswagens. Thrill to the cars. I love it. Throb to the deals. May 17th through 28th, the Volkswagen Success Celebration. Rated BW. I'm Alex Tapper, president of First City Builders, your custom-built replacement window headquarters. Here's a model of our windows, which we bring into every home. I want you to notice the money-saving thermal brake design, which prevents freezing, frost, sweat, and fuel waste, and comes in your choice of vinyl or aluminum frames. Now I want you to notice how little they cost, just $19 a month, $19 for all this quality. There's no obligation, so call for your free home estimate now. First City Builders, 481-9099, 481-9099. Domestic violence does not only exist on television. Every 18 seconds, a woman is beaten. These women are crying out for help. The Milwaukee Women's Refuge, we need your support. Next week on Movie 12. This is no ordinary mystery. Can't touch nothing. This is Agatha Christie's most perfect crime. Murder on the Orient Express. Starring the greatest cast of suspicious characters ever involved in murder. The murderer is with us now. been waiting for it, it's here. Copeland's giant warehouse sale, two days only. Lowest prices of the year on appliances. Save on Amana Maytag GE. Save on KitchenAid Westinghouse Frigidaire. Save on Sharp, Whirlpool, and Gen Air. Many items at cost or below cost, and you won't get better service anywhere. Free 90-day financing. Don't miss Copeland's warehouse sale this weekend only. Always shop Copeland. Before you buy. Just to be sure. I went to several dealerships not only in the Milwaukee area, but outside of Milwaukee. And I came to Phil Token because I got definitely the best deal. Ask yourself, why is Phil Token sold more Pontiacs in Wisconsin than anyone else? So why go anywhere else? Why waste uh, time and money when you can uh, get the best buy? For a great deal on Pontiac Arizusu, shouldn't you be talking Phil Token to? The deal was just fantastic at Phil Token Pontiac. Hard floor was okay when mommy and daddy held me a lot. But now that I'm ready to walk, I wanted something soft to walk on. So mommy called Lincoln, and they came right over with three rooms of real soft carpeting for only $289. Ooh, 
Ooh, carpeting soft enough for my first steps and oops, <laughs> my first falls too. Remember, Lincoln's installers are trained lots better than I am. Call 271-7060, 271-7060. Children's Hospital Telethon. June 1st and 2nd. This is Channel 12 News with Mike Anderson and the Channel 12 News Team. Good evening, everyone. Yesterday, United Auto Workers in Kenosha voted to go to the bargaining table instead of granting major concessions to American Motors. Well, today, Milwaukee's UAW membership took its vote on the issue, as Tom Andrews reports. Kenosha United Auto Workers have made it very clear. They want to keep this AMC plant open, but they're not ready to just hand over major contract concessions to American Motors. Yesterday, the workers voted overwhelmingly to open early contract negotiations with the automaker. And today in Milwaukee, their UAW counterparts took the same action. 96% of the more than 300 workers who turned out at Serve Hall said it's time to go to the bargaining table, not to panic. And that's all it is. That's, that's not a response to their ultimatum. We reject their ultimatum completely. Uh, the negotiations, I think, will sit down just as a... Our president, uh, Mr. Nick Romano, pointed out that uh, we're willing to discuss every single issue in there, but on a point-by-point -point basis through negotiations. Without major concessions from the workers by next Friday, AMC officials have said they would have to close its plants in Kenosha and Milwaukee. But while those officials weren't available for comment today on how the worker votes may have changed the picture, UAW members remain confident the plants will stay open. I am optimistic. But it's, you know, it's sort of in limbo right now. It's hard to, hard to say. It's the company's ball now, and if they don't uh, come to the table, I think uh, their minds were already made up on what they want to do. The current contracts, which affect about 6,500 workers in Kenosha and Milwaukee, will expire September 15th. Tom Andrews, Channel 12 News, Milwaukee. Congressman Jim Moody and Gerald Kletchka sponsored a special hearing in Milwaukee today to get input about the 1986 federal budget. Key leaders from business, education, and labor were on hand to testify about how they feel the budget should be put together. The Republican-controlled Senate passed its version of the budget last week, and as the Democrat-controlled House drafts its budget proposal, many are calling for some sort of legislation to keep plants from shutting down and keep the jobs right here in Milwaukee. Well, I can't uh, envision any law which would mandate employers and companies stay in a particular area because of the freedom they have and we all have. They are free to, um, uh, to leave if they so desire. I think uh, the government can ensure that there's proper notification so employees can make the necessary plans. However, I think even before we go to that point, government on all levels should ensure that the business climate is not adverse to, uh, uh, to those jobs staying in any particular area. Kletchka added that the move to reduce the top Wisconsin income tax to 7.9% would be a positive step, shedding a favorable light on the state's business climate. Governor Tony Earle is reportedly pleased with the revised state budget. It calls for $868 million in property tax relief. He won't be able to sign the legislation until it's out of the House Ways and Means Committee. That should be sometime late next month. Earle would like to reinstate the hospital rate setting commission, which was abolished in this budget. In his weekly radio address, President Reagan said he's ready to do what he does best, take his case to the American people. The president said he'll go to the people if Congress doesn't come up with what he called a suitable compromise on military spending. During the Democratic response, South Carolina Congressman Butler Derrick said the plan to freeze Pentagon spending provides national defense without neglecting social programs. Airline passengers holding United plane tickets have been stranded across the country as the United pilot strike enters day two. Some senior citizens who had planned to fly the friendly skies home to Chicago became angry when they found themselves grounded in Reno, Nevada. Ticket agents have been scrambling to book would-be United passengers onto other airlines. Here in Milwaukee, United has cut its daily flights to in and out of Mitchell Field down from five to one. Milwaukee-based pilots say they're thinking of setting up a fund to help out their striking co-workers. Those of us who are old enough and don't need the strike benefits anymore will turn them back into a fund for the younger people that do need them. People with big house payments to make and kids in school and things like that. I can get along without them. 
Late tonight, United Airlines and pilots agreed to resume contracts talks on Monday. The pilots are striking over a company demand that would put newly hired pilots on a lower pay schedule. Police in Cancun, Mexico are looking for a suspect in connection with the shooting of 23-year-old Julie Braun of Milwaukee. Braun was in her hotel room Thursday night when she was shot. The bullet penetrated her skull and her condition is listed as extremely delicate. Testimony was cut short today in the trial of Tommy Lamont Bobo. Bobo is accused of shooting and killing Cheryl Robinson and her daughter, Janetta. This morning, the prosecution was questioning Milwaukee police detectives about a search conducted at the home of Bobo's parents when a green jacket was mentioned. The defense attorney objected to that testimony because he had filed a motion to suppress information gathered by the search warrant. The judge agreed, and a hearing on that motion was in order. Regardless of the relevancy of that coat or any of those items, Mr. Bowler was entitled to have that hearing prior to the jury hearing that evidence. And so we, I don't care if it's relevant, I don't care what the jury's told, because of perhaps the unintentional violation of my order, I feel obligated to give Mr. Bowler his hearing at this point. So frankly, it doesn't make any difference to me whether or not that code is relevant or not relevant or what the jury is told, because Mr. Bowler had a right to have that motion heard prior to the jury hearing that evidence. A hearing on that motion was scheduled for Monday. The victim of a house fire early today in Kenosha has been identified as 75-year-old James Stancato. Stancato, who lived alone, was found in the bathroom. Officials believe he was trying to fill a pan of water to douse the flames. A motorist noticed smoke and flames coming from the house about 6 a.m. The state fire marshal is investigating. Florida is in the midst of a major environmental disaster. Fires have destroyed over 100,000 acres of grasslands, timber forests, and everglades. Two men have died fighting the blazes, and the fires continue to burn out of control. Countless homes, schools, and businesses have been burned to the ground in a third of the state's counties. Yesterday, the fires burned electrical cables, which uh, put four and a half million customers in the dark in Miami, Fort Lauderdale, and the Palm Beaches. Cause of the various fires are being blamed on lighting and arson fueled by abnormally dry conditions and high winds. More hot, windy weather is predicted for tomorrow. Coming up, the Pope celebrates his birthday, and five years after Mount St. Helens erupts. We'll have reports on both of those stories in just a moment. The race is on during your Lincoln Mercury dealer's $60 million sales drive. We broke the sales record in April, and we're out to keep the pace going in May. With 8.8 .8 annual percentage rate financing on any new Continental Mark 7 or new 85 and a half links. Also, save hundreds and hundreds of dollars on Marquee, Grand Marquee, and Cougar option packages. There's even savings on limited edition Cougar and Lynx models. The $60 million sales drive, coming on strong at your Lincoln Mercury dealer today. Don't let it pass you by. <laughs> If you were to conduct a survey anywhere in the world to identify the number one super premium beer, you'd pick Milwaukee, Beer Town, USA. The Milwaukee Journal did just that. And the number one super premium brand is Heilman Special Export. I repeat, the number one super premium beer in Milwaukee, where people really know beer, is Heilman Special Export. Think it over. You can travel the world over and never find a better beer. What do you do when 63 kids need a good meal? Even dedicated mothers like me need a break. Who are you going to turn to? These days, I turn to the Colonel for fresh cooked tender chicken with all the fixings. Who are you going to turn to? Who are you going to turn to? Do you live here? No, but Bobby says you're having Kentucky Fried Chicken. Kentucky Fried Chicken, we do chicken right. You know, Hacksaw, people, they... They just don't understand guys like us. Yeah, they think we're all bulk and no brains. Hacks where they should see now pumping Amoco Premium. Shows you know a lot about gasoline, right? Wrong, but my car knows. Why do more drivers rate Amoco Premium lead-free the highest quality gasoline? Your car knows. We should move the car. Now? Now. Right. We don't want to put this hacksaw. How about down? Amoco, your car knows. Comedian Joan Rivers was in Milwaukee tonight for a performance at the Riverside Theater. While she drew laughs from her audience, she drew protests from local telephone operators. Members of the Communication Workers of America manned a picket line outside the theater to protest commercials Rivers does for MCI Communications. They claim those commercials depict AT&T operators as brainless airheads. 
and this is their way of fighting back. We want people to know we're out, we're out there, and we're, when they need an operator, we're there, and we are not meaningless airhead people. We are hardworking for the, for the public. Operators all across the country have been staging similar pickets. Rivers declines to comment on the protests. About 200 Korean students participated in a demonstration today marking the fifth anniversary of a bloody anti-government uprising. 200 people died fighting government troops. 100 students were arrested today when they tried to march to a nearby cemetery for a memorial service. Pope John Paul II celebrated his 65th birthday in Belgium today. He spoke to more than 40,000 young people about what he called the evils of drugs, unbridled sex, and other traps the devil sets to exploit the weak. The Pope told one cheering audience that young people were right to be outspoken about injustice, the lack of employment, and the fact that so many people are starving in the world. And on a more happy note, there was a birthday cake baked for the public. A 41-year-old Jefferson man is in critical but stable condition tonight after receiving a heart transplant yesterday in Madison. Julius Arms was the sixth person to receive a heart transplant at the University Hospital since the program was resumed last May. A small parade, a scientific open house, and a few small stirrings from Mount St. Helens itself mark the fifth anniversary of the volcano's cataclysmic eruption. On May 18, 1980, Mount St. Helens staged its biggest eruption, leaving 57 people dead or missing and clogging rivers around the mountain with volcanic debris. Now, five years later, plants are coming back and the animals starting to return. Scientists caution today that it's much too early to say whether the volcano, which has been quiet since September, may be building toward yet another eruption. We don't have to concern ourselves with uh, volcanic eruptions. Not, not directly. Part. No, not directly. at least not in our forecast. The worst uh, that may be occurring or the best, depending upon your outlook, could be a couple of showers late tomorrow. Okay. We'll be back with Robin in just a moment. The 60s was the wild look. The 70s was the let it be look. The 80s is the neat look. And Vitalis lets it be your look to style or groom, or hold. Vitalis makes it look better any way you wear your hair. Always good looking, natural, and very well groomed. For the neat look of the 80s, America's great classic, Vitalis has it all. So you can have it all. Some look-alike gasolines give you look-alike performance. Shell SU-2000 is different. It's a patented, high-octane gasoline designed for smooth, quiet power. And it fights critical engine deposits that can cause knock. If your car is giving you look-alike performance, try Shell SU-2000 Super Unleaded Gasoline. Turn your car into an SU-2000 performer. Simplicity lasts. Here's down-to-earth proof. Dear Simplicity, after 15 years, we are still enjoying excellent service from our mower, even though it was driven into the swimming pool in 1974. It survived and is none the worse for the experience today. Simplicity does last. Remember that before you sink your money into a mower. Make sure it's got what it takes underneath. Thousands of immigrants brought their dreams of a new life.